Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are in your beautiful day. Well done for tuning in and giving yourself some love. We're heading into back. We're going to start on the floor. We are going to come up, but I want to do a couple of exercises on the floor. All right. Um, remember when we're working back, we're going to get a lot of core work, okay? Yes, and you're ready. Shake it out when you need to. Stretch when you need to. Prepare to feel a little uncomfortable. We're going to be lying on our chest for the first move. Um, but remember, don't push through pain, any like abnormal pain. And focus on lengthening rather than height. Let height be a secondary part of the exercise and focus on the lengthen away all right i want your hands like this so we get between your shoulders and we're gonna go this we're gonna be on our front but this is how it's gonna go i i position into y into a t into y into i lower down i want you to breathe um you're gonna find you might hold your breath okay and you will need a resistance band and weights for this session as well. All right, ladies, 15 minutes. Are we ready? Laying on your front here, hands turn into paddles, legs are doing nothing. Just leave your lower body alone. Once you've got the exercise, tuck your chin in. So we're gonna breathe out. Hands are in paddles here. Exhale up. Y, T, Y, I and lower. Exhale up. Y, tuck your chin in. T. Y, I, lower. Y, Y. T, shoulders down. Y, focus on lengthening. I, lower. Exhale out. Head into eight. This is repetition. Four. Y. T. I want you to think about what we're working here. We're working our back and lower. Exhale out. Y. T. Y. I. Lower. Three more. If you need to go a little lower, core super switched on, breathe. Try not to hold your breath. Y, I, lower. Last two. Y, T, Y, I, lower. Last one. Y. T. Y. I. Lower. Gently tuck your arms in and slowly release out of it because we did a lot of work in the lower back. Take yourself into child pose. All right, second exercise, we've got three on the floor, and then we'll come up. Again, it's a Pilates move, I want you to push the floor away nice and long. This back leg can be on the floor or off the floor. You're gonna salute yourself. Take your time, elbow comes into the hand, and there's two parts of this exercise. So I want the open, and I want the rotation. One, open. Eight each side, two. Try and be nice and smooth with your body. Three. Four. Take your time. Five, keep that back hip facing down. Breathe. You're gonna get 
a lot of oblique work here, so work into your waist. Eight. And gently in. Round your spine for me, tuck the tailbone, release any lower back. And we're gonna go into the other side, nice and strong, strong, shoulders down, tuck your elbows inwards. Other leg, up or down, you decide, salute yourself. Come in as low as you can and open. Focus on your balance, one. tailbone under and arch and relax there all right grab your resistance bands preferably one that's like a medium or medium or heavy strength you're going to stay seated option just to have the one one leg Depends how flexible you are, we'll go for the two. Sit as tall as you can, shoulders down, around your spine. And if you've ever done horse riding before, I want you to pull inwards, tuck your elbows in, hold here. If you've not got resistance bands, um, grab a hand towel and just go for the same movement here. Hold, nice and strong. See if you can pull your tummy in, lift. And I want you to work every bit of your back right now. So you know how we do like those ready rows or we do a woman maker? Um, this is similar movement. Hold four, three, two, or one. So this is um, needed. <laughs> Lift. Ames, I'm so glad you said do back. I was like, yes. Hold. Four, three, two, or one. I might go for a little heavier here. really need this. Three, two, one. Remember you can have it around one leg as well. Shoulders down, in. Think of working right behind your breasts. Four, three, two, one, release. Inwards and upwards, sit as tall as you can. Four, three, two, and one. And release. Felt amazing. All right, on our front, we're going to do this again and then we're going to come up to standing. Ready? So let's go for the hands apart. I YT, YI, tuck your chin in, exhale, lift, Y, T, Y, I, lower. Remember we're focusing on lengthening away, I, Y, T, Y, I, lower. I, T, I, I, 
Good, we'll four more. nice and slow elbow coming inwards and open up one and two tuck the shoulder the elbow slightly down as you open three Salute yourself. In. One. Two. Elbow comes down as you open. Three. actually really good. <laughs> really do that more. Shoulders down, pull in, hold. See if you can pull your tummy. Three, two, one, release. See if you can give me tummy first, then pull back.
Last one. to our feet. I want to do two exercises together. Either go for a heavier weight or a lighter weight in the first move and then second move go light because it, it will go into your shoulders but I don't want your shoulders to be the main. The main. Come on, let's go. I'm going to shift you up now. Two exercises, that's it, all right? All right, so we're gonna go into a standing Rennie row. You're gonna have to use your glutes. Otherwise your lower back is not gonna like you. From here, sit in your glutes, take your body over. We're gonna exhale, pull your abs in, and pull those arms in, shoulders back and down. Now when your eyes are down, once you've got the move, hold, four, three, two, one, release. Exhale, four, three, two, one. Think of this as like being a chicken. Exhale in, four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. Just make sure you're not folding at the wrists here. So strong in your wrists. Four, three, two, or one. Slow. Four, three, two, or one. Four, three, two, or one. Go for one more here. Four, three, two, one. Release. And deadlift up. Be careful of your lower back there. That's a good exercise to go quite heavy with. If you want, depending where you are. Alright, standing nice and tall. If you want to work more core, go on to that one leg. Or pop it on its toe, depending where you are. I want you to come up and I want you slowly opening up. Wide down. So if you're working a little heavier, just keep that foot down wide. Shake it out when you need to. Come up into that deadlift and back down. Take it over here. Exhale in. One. Slow release. Head into ten. Two. Three. Four. Elbows coming in and down. So make sure they're not up by your shoulders. Five. Five. Four. Three. 
three. Two. One. See if you can stand in that dead left and release. A lot of glutes. <laughs> All right, ready. Last move, balance or not around the world. Straighten up in your supporting leg. Three. Four, focus on the way down. Shoulders a little roll. Roll your neck nice and soft here. And hold it here. Round your spine. Tuck your pelvis under. Length from the bottom to the top. And open up. Lower back. Give me a little back bend. Mouth together. Big love and let me know how you get on. Definitely want to save and definitely want to get in, in like even just in your monthly schedule. If you just add it in like, yeah, I'm gonna do this once a month or every 10 days, I would say. I think, um, I think we'll be doing that as well. Yeah, me too. Well done, Ames, thanks for suggesting. I really needed it as well, so yeah. Big love, honey. Mwah. Love your energy. So pleased you're here. Bye, honey.